What's good, my fellow introverts? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Mina here back with another commentary video. Guys, I'm here with a brand new trailer reaction. As you can see by the title, this is Bridgerton's sneak peek for season three. It's about um give or take probably approximately <laughs> about 40 to 38 minutes long it says for 49 but i guess i'm gonna exclude like the 10 seconds of outro or whatever so i'm very excited to see what season three has for me i have made a couple of assumptions the um right now i'm looking at colin's face he looks airbrushed thoroughly <laughs> i know with each side character like in season one you know they kind of look a little musty dusty crusty <laughs> They don't look bad or anything. Like with Anthony, we got to know him and he seemed, you know, not as airbrushed as season two. You know, he, he had that little season two and he came out of the water and he was just like, oh, glazed. <laughs> I'm ready to see matured Penelope. This is her season. This is her time. This is Lady Whistledown. So I'm very excited and I want to jump right in. But of course, as always, I got to remind you guys to like and subscribe and to join my mailing list on thebookcinema.com, guys. If you subscribe to my channel and subscribe to thebookcinema.com, all you got to do is scroll down. I'm going to insert a little video. Scroll down. You'll see the subscribe fill in your email and you'll join my mailing list and not only do you get 50% off made the introvert store on etsy you also are able to participate in my current giveaway that is lasting until february 14th guys so guys make sure you check it out take a chance i've decided i'm not gonna um say what the prizes are prize I'm not going to say anything about the prize, like what the prize is, until like the day before the giveaway um, ends. So I hope you guys participate. I just want to have a little fun. Just give back to all my wonderful subscribers, you know, and um, yeah. So please check it out, guys. Again, all you got to do is subscribe to this channel and then go over to thebooksyoutheman.com, my website, and join my mailing list. You will be able to see the subscribe button all the way down at the bottom of the page or it might just pop up the like box will likely pop up for you guys so uh yeah don't forget to stick around till the end of this video i don't think i'm gonna really put much at it but i'm gonna jump right in let's get into prison turn season three sneak peek i'm ready okay let's stare in context your eyes the most remarkable shade of blue Yet somehow they shine even brighter when you are kind. I, I might say something like that if you were a, a suitor. Guys, I'm here. Oh, <laughs> this is all we get, you monsters. Oh, it's in parts. Part one and two. Let's let's go right back. Cause I was like, why is Colin staring at Penelope? I knew from like her. I didn't see her like on screen, but I knew that was her hair, her hair color. So I assumed that was her. So I was like, why is he having us? staring contest with penelope let's see let's see one more time had that man blushing I, I might say something like that if you were a seat oh my god <laughs> i'm here well that was uh rather direct uh, um <clears throat> i'm here for it oh and i'm i think i heard eloise in the back so it's very likely that they're still not really cool at least i'm, I'm assuming because she seemed a little tense and it's stiff but what i've seen so far i am liking guys very short like i said but telling telling so much because pen has been harboring this crush like in her soul her depths <laughs> for how long um probably as long as she has been neighbors with the bridgetons she is best friend with eloise and you know they she have the brother best um, the best friend's brother and stuff like that. So it's kind of it's kind of very interesting. You know, we don't get to see this side of Penelope during the seasons. We just see her just thirsting after Colin, just you know, after nipping at his heels. You know, I'm glad to see her. I don't know, bold and more mature. You know, you like she's like your eyes. 
you know she's not saying it like all desperately she's saying it seriously just like i don't know it's just you could tell that this is her season <laughs> like she's an adult in this in this year or whatever and you know obviously colin is the muse and the weather is like my god i mean penelope is eloquent we have heard her speak when she's in business form you know but we never seen it with colin have we we seen a little bit when she was talking about her purpose um she's like my purpose is to get away from her mother yeah like like this like stuff like that i feel like that is her persona that is her true persona and not this giggly mm, this naive little thing that's you know chasing Colin and I think that is what is gonna pull me into season three I don't know how it's gonna go I don't know how passionate it's gonna be like I said we've seen little girl Penelope and we've seen a bit of her maturity when she is in business lady lady whistle down form and I'm loving her as that her I prefer her that way than the little giggly kind of airheadish kind of girl but we have to well at least I hope we all realize that that giggly part of her maybe um maybe is actually part of her but it, I think it was a front you know to mislead people <laughs> into thinking she's like completely innocent right at least that's how I I am looking at it now that's her personality is the writer the author and then the the giggly girl is just the little girl is um a front to throw off you know society and stuff people think she's like an airhead basically and colin probably thought the same <laughs> it's very likely colin is gonna find out about her being lady whistle down obviously i don't know when but i'm excited for that reveal what is what that is gonna cause because i know how hard it hit eloise eloise was like never speak to me again <laughs> never speaking to you again stay away from my family you know like who is eloise gonna tell is she gonna even tell anyone will anyone believe her why would they um penelope of all people i mean she's played the giggly airhead well you know and i think that would irritate me more that she was just so thirsty I mean, you could thirst after your crush. I understand it. It's a crush. But just witnessing how almost desperate she was and not like, you know, more upfront with her feelings, you know, instead of just being like, oh my God, but Colin, you know, like, I don't know. I, I think I prefer her. I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know how to explain it. It's like, I prefer her as how she is here, bolder, upfront you know claire about how she's feeling and she might not have been claire exactly like <laughs> totally upfront but she was i don't know she was just mature about it i don't know i love it i know it, it crushes can can make you a little silly and make you a little jealous a little frustrated and a little thirsty it's okay it's part of growing up and and stuff like that but like I guess I just really like seeing Penelope adulting in the sense that she is finding herself she is secure um she heard her she heard her crush talking shit about her basically like Penelope never <laughs> not necessarily shit but like he was like yeah I would never be with Penelope you know she heard that and she finally found herself she's like okay fine you know move on you know and i'm pretty sure someone in the comments mentioned that that's i was really on point on uh, what is going to happen for season three so i'm i'm hoping that colin wakes up and sees and he seems to be seeing <laughs> he seems to be seeing penelope as a more um as a more more than this his little sister's friend and that, I think that's a good description of her person, personality. The little sister's friend that, you know, maybe follows me around a little, you know. But yeah, I'm here for it. I'm very excited. Penelope had that boy blushing. I am here for that. Penelope is Lady Whistledown. She, she could move some people with some words, you know. 
and I'm ready to to see her have Colin on his on his knees. I <laughs> I want a little desperation from Colin. I want him to be thirsting, okay? I want him to be nipping at her heels, okay? <laughs> okay? I am ready for this season. So guys, um, please like, subscribe. Don't forget to join my mailing list on thebooktodemand.com and check out me in the introvert store on Etsy, guys. Stick around till the end of the video. I have a little sneak peeks from my store on what's new and everything. So guys, make sure you check that out. And yeah, that's it for this video. I'm ready for season three. Until next time. Bye.